forewarned weather with Exact Track 4D radar. Exclusive technology for the most up to the minute weather information in your neighborhood. Okay, so we took a peek at Southfield earlier. This is Mount Clemens, where we see the sun shining there as well. Our winter weather roller coaster starting to climb again. It does feel better than yesterday. It does, and right? it's just going to keep getting yeah. warmer and warmer each day. And, you know, it's the end of the month, so we like to do a recap mm -hmm. of February, and it was definitely a warm month. In fact, it will go down in the record books as the third warmest February in history. The second warmest was in 2017 at 37.9. So we were very, very close to that second place position. And then the warmest or the mildest was back in 1882. Normal is 28 degrees. So we are definitely warmer than average for the month of February. And we're going into March like a lamb, you know, in like a lamb, out like a lion. Hopefully it will be in like a lamb, out like a lamb as well. 20, uh, wind chills are in the 20s, but temps are in the 30s, 38 in Detroit, mid 30s in Howell, 33 in Lapeer and 38 in Monroe. It is a little warmer. It's also not as windy as it was yesterday afternoon. So it uh, just feels a little bit better, and especially with that sunshine. Upper 30s downtown, 36 in Mount Clemens, 34 in Port Huron, the cool spot. 29 in Sandusky, upper 30s in Monroe, Metro, and Ann Arbor all checking in at 38 degrees. Not really much to talk about as far as the clouds and radar goes. There's obviously some lake effect snow off to our east and then just a little bit of cloudiness and a few snow showers up in the northern part of the state. But otherwise, we're nice and sunny here and we'll stay that way for a while. In fact, 6 a.m. for your morning commute, mostly sunny skies. But as we go throughout the day tomorrow, you'll notice some clouds start to build in in the afternoon. And then 24 hours from now, we'll have mostly cloudy skies. There could be a few holes in the overcast allowing for some sunshine, but overall it will be a cloudy afternoon and then it clears back out just in time for the weekend. Look at this climb. 47 tomorrow. One thing to notice about this that, that I love is that we are now up to 40 degrees for our average. So it's no longer normal for us to be in the 30s. Not that we won't be again, but it's not normal. 40 Friday and Saturday, the normal highs. 47 will be the high tomorrow. We're in the mid 50s for Saturday, 62 Sunday and near 70 degrees for Monday. Looks like March, the outlook is in and we will be above average for temps. In fact, well above average for temps and below average for precip. Your forecast for tonight, uh, we'll just call it mostly clear skies, although there could be a few clouds rolling in. 29 will be your overnight low, so that's about 10 degrees warmer than last night. Then tomorrow, because we're starting out in the upper 20s, it's a little bit of an easier climb in the afternoon. We'll make it to 47 degrees, so above average temps. And then the future forecast, beautiful weekend ahead with sunshine both days. Monday near 70, and then we're back down into the 50s, but even the 50s below average, and we don't see rain until next week, Karen. Wow. All right. Thank you, Kim.